Dear gamers, as you can see, we have switched locations because I now live in Japan. If, if you somehow haven't kept up to date with the channel, despite, you know, all the posting. But I have moved to my dorm and the background has changed, but my setup is also different because I'm running this off of my laptop and ZBD Pats fan is going to come through with a year and a half just like that right off the bat. Let's go. Josh is going to tell me to go to bed because it's 11.30 p.m. here in Japan, but you know I can't go to bed before I open my packs. So, today, um, I, so basically, I arrived in Japan uh, about a week ago, about a week ago, and um, I've been busy ever since. Like, just, not just with work and, like, paperwork and uni, but also just, like, enjoying the TCG industry. Like, this last weekend we had Daivangasai, I bought a bunch of stuff, got some amazing presents like this. Shadowbox, 3D Dykeiser from, from Gacha-san, you know, just been buying so many cards, like playing in tournaments. We got top 8, we got top 8 in um, the standard team event at Daivangasai, like, you know, it's been amazing. For the TCG of Vanguard, that is, I got to meet the legendary Aren-san as well at Daivangasai, like, you know, so many great things. But while all those great things were happening... Zero goes and says, hey, um, GNX next month. Also, two sets in one month for, like, no reason. So, they decided that it would be a good idea. And, um, no tier list and set review video last month? Yeah, because I was busy, man. I was busy. The tier list will come out. Set reviews are dead. Set reviews don't perform well enough <laughs> for me to bother doing them anymore. So they decided to release two different packs for the same set. As you can see, Side Blessing and Side Judgment. Cho Goku Shinpan is... Yeah, Cho Goku Shinpan is the set. So, Absolute Judgment. Absolute Judgment was the eighth set of G. And that means we're getting Luard next month. And I don't know how to feel about that. It's um very weird. It's very weird. So basically, we have two sides of the set. One side has um, Royals, Link Joker, and Gear Chronicle. So basically just three clans and four Gear Chronicle GRs. And then the Blessing side has um, Pale Moon, Grand Blue, Bermuda, and Neo Nectar in it. So this one has a bit more clans. But the thing is that, like, these GRs are... Like, decent, but unless you play Bermuda, like, this side is a skip. Like, Bloom is cool, but Asha already gets carried by Thuri. I don't really need the Bloom stuff that much. And the, this PG got nerfed to hell, which was, like, one of the main things you would normally pick up. So it's not even really that worth it anymore. And, like, this stride is good. So, like, this, this stride is pretty cool, but that's about it. And then the like, Gouache is really not that great. Sorry, not you. Gouache isn't that great because you don't have Sea Strong Banshee to Soul Charge. So you want your remaining soul for your lazies and stuff like that. So, I don't really like the Blessing side much, there's really nothing great. Yeah, like, Pale Moon got nerfed for, like, what, whatever, like, you know, Leslie going to once per turn, like, I get it, but, like, not now. You can patch that in later, don't need to do it now. So this side, basically, like, it has a bunch of really mid-Gear Chronicle support, outside of, like, Gear Groovy being pretty decent, but even Gear Groovy feels kind of weird, together with, you know, like, the G's on expanded 12 cards, also that happened, apparently. Like, I was just too busy with the tournaments to really look at the news um, these last couple days, but G's on went to 12 cards, apparently, which is interesting. Um, so Gear Groovy gets a little bit better, I guess. And at least Fides seems kind of nice and generic on top of the Brave stuff. And Flagiolet also is kind of cool, or Flagiolet, rather, is also pretty cool, too. But, yeah. So, yeah. First, zero pack opening in Japan, but it's also super late because I was just busy with stuff today. Um, so it's like almost midnight here. So let's keep things snappy. So basically, I am... I'm probably going to be making a video about, you know, the state of zero. Because, let's be real, it ain't great. <laughs> let's be honest here. The way zero is, is not great. And it's super prohibitive for people getting into the game. And I'm going to be real with you. If you're a Zero player, and you don't play Overdress yet, if you don't play the TCG yet, these starter decks are 4 bucks. Do yourself a favor, and play Overdress. Like, I'm being serious here, I'm, I'm not kidding. Because, even if you don't have a local area, even if you live in the middle of nowhere, 
you live in a freaking village that has Wi-Fi, just make, like, literally put, point your phone or webcam down, play remote. This will make you feel better about your life than Zero does right now. So, I will still be making Zero content, of course, because I still enjoy it. I still enjoy playing the game, but I hate, like, everything about the monetization of it and the development of it. But I, I really enjoy playing it. And I like playing ranked, and I think it's fun to play it, but to get to the point where you can play it comfortably, it sucks, right? That's that's basically the point I'm trying to make here. So, I don't want to open too many packs, because I'm really not a fan of their practices these days. And I, like, I, I love Vanguard and it really hurts me because... This I was so hyped about Zero and I used to really look forward to playing it every day until they started to get increasingly money grabby with every month, you know? So we're gonna open some packs, but basically I'm going for like Fides and like Flagulet and like maybe Gear Groovy, but none of these are really my main clans, so I'm not really going too crazy about it. So let's just have some fun, celebrate the fact that, you know, I managed to move into Japan very successfully. I've met a lot of the big Zero players yesterday, and that was really, really fun. And, you know, Zero is a, has been a great game in the past, and has the potential to be a really good game. It has the potential to get better and better and better, but that potential is not being explored. This could be a platform that grows this franchise beyond description like beyond comprehension and they choose to not take that opportunity for no reason and i think that that is just like that that is beyond me i cannot comprehend why they would do that you know so they're speed running through g for no reason when they could have been taking their sweet time and so here we are but yeah and again i'm running the stream off my laptop you're gonna have a little sound delay between what's happening on stream and the actual sound also, they, yeah, added like you get van like the, the the V coupons from opening packs now, which is interesting. So yeah, I didn't even pre-order this set. Like you don't normally have like more of the packs. Um, <laughs> Far from MBT, have done a better job of getting Vanguard some clout. <laughs> That's not zero though. Vanguard itself, I think, doesn't struggle to get clout, especially with how amazing the TCG is. It's all good, and especially how amazing Overdress is. Overdress is just, I love it. I love it so much. All right, we have a triple R in here. Show me fat GRs. Give me that. Give me that JP buff. You know I'm connected to the servers. I'm 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 breathing. I'm breathing the GRs. You know, I'm breathing the GR air. The GR oxygen. So clearly my poles need to be a little bit stacked. You know. All right. Every oh yeah. Then there's the Master Duel comparison. I don't like the Master Duel comparison anymore because Konami really dropped the ball with Master Duel. So in the long term, I would not want our Vanguard simulator to be like that. <laughs> I'm gonna be real with you. Okay, Huang Long. That's a triple. Is that our first triple and only triple? Yes, it is. All right. Damn it. Maybe complaining is actually doing a terrible job <laughs> for these packs. <laughs> One triple out of like what? Thirteen packs? Yeah, thirteen packs. Oh yeah, there's a new Legion. There's a bunch of Legion. Oh, first time I see this card, what is it? Sex of Anger, Soul Boss 1. Oh, your opponent can't guard zero guard? Grade zero guard? Oh, wait, it's just the, it's just Pazurli. Dude, why? Why does he look so cool? Why does he look so sick? Not bad. Not bad. That's it. <laughs> Damn, he do be chill as hell though. Yeah, it's an alternate art. So yeah, like this whole like split pack thing is like, why would you do that? It's... I mean, I understand that you want people to just, like, pick a deck and play it. Even I'm now in that position where it's like... I, I literally, like, I don't play... I don't seriously play any of the clans in here. So therefore, as a result, I'm like, well, I don't need to go in much. Because I don't play them, right? But then, uh, from a game perspective, from a developer's perspective, that's also not good. If you have a bunch of people going like, well, I'm not gonna pull this because I don't care. Oh, Corner to G. Sadly, he's pretty mid. <laughs> he's really not great because doesn't have any like rewind effects like the original one. So that's a bit unfortunate. Alright, we have something in here. Oh, delay blazer, that's good. 
I want like a one or two of maybe for the actual Corn Jet deck, not like Zodiac Time Beasts. Because the stuff for the Zodiac Time Beasts in this set isn't really Zodiac Time Beast stuff like the way that we remember it. So, you know, that's kind of part of it. Alright, we got like what, two triples from this, I think? Something like that? Yeah, two triples. Two triples. Just big chillin'. Big vibin'. Hey! Alright, last of the free packs. Starter deck ZTBs? Yeah, so like some of the stuff, like most of the stuff is like rares and commons. Some double rares. So, but stuff like um, Split Pegasus and stuff is just not in here. So that's gonna be next set probably. How goes the pull? So far, so mid. <laughs> what can I say? Me being somewhat negative is definitely reflecting on the packs. Okay, we got a tick away. Tick away is pretty good, actually. Kaliboom is in the set. Kaliboom is not in the game yet, actually. Not in the set either. So they're purposefully avoiding it. Luckily, some of the good cards in this set are also rares and commons. Especially for gears, because there's so much of them. So much gear stuff in the set. Oh, nice. That's an SP. Uh, no, regular Selim. Regular Selim and a Chrono Fang triple. That's okay. Does JP have Chrono Gen already? We've had Chrono Gen for a while. We have Chrono Gen G already this set, this month. So that's pretty cool. Oh, the crit. Oh, I forgot that's a double rare. The Chrono Fang crit. All right. Hmm. Two triples. So far, I feel like we've only been pulling gears. I would like... I really need Slayman, so this guy's got to start popping up soon. And one of these two, I hope, pop up eventually. <laughs> they are pretty cool dudes. But yeah, like, I look through this set, I'm just like... I still have so many things to play from the previous things, like from the previous sets and like videos to do, that I'm not really pressed with this set, like just, you know... And like some of the things I can just like craft the GRs at this point, like I might as well just craft them. So, yeah. Very weird pack opening, huh? Usually we're just like popping off, going crazy, but now it's like... I think it's just because I've kind of, you know, I've been able to talk to people IRL that, you know, we don't hear as much from about their actual feelings, and also just being back in the heart of the TCG industry in Tokyo and being able to play physical TCGs every day, which I know is a very privileged position and I'm very much aware of that, you know, how... because I know how much... how lucky I am because of having lived in Europe with a tiny-ass anger community where I didn't have that kind of privilege, right? Oh, Cornerfang, hello. That's nice. I I'm sure Cornerfang will be a rank reward eventually. It would be weird if he wasn't. But yeah, so, at least the one good thing is thanks to the, like, the way character fights work, and, um, how much crafting materials you get, at least you can complete, like, you can build triples and doubles pretty easily, so I can actually, you know, get my slay mines even if I don't pull them, which is cool, I guess. So yeah. If you're a dedicated Messiah player, Flagula is like a 3-up. Yeah, like, if we get Flagula, we just, or Flagula, we just reset, for sure. I hope I can pull one. These packs have been kind of whack so far. <laughs> Come on, GRs? Where are y'all at? You're supposed to be epic in gaming. Um, I'm happy to own one because this is my favorite artist. It is Obari Sensei, it is Dykeiser's artist. But this is like the worst GR. <laughs> <laughs> ah, funny Minecraft mode. <laughs> when the Demi is Urge. <laughs> got Tengen all well in the first five packs. See, you global guys got a really good set. This set you just got in global? Love it. Would, would give it a smooch. Would give it a smooch. A peck on the lips. Take it from you? Alright. It's yours, buddy. Go say it. <laughs> All right, no other GRs exist apparently. Nope, they don't. They do not. Casually pulled five GRs from fifty packs. Can you? Can you not? Stop, man. So the art goes hard, right? Feel free to screenshot. You have my permission. The art goes dummy hard. Dummy hard, demi erg. But 
Man. Where are my, my boys at? I'm already running out of gems. I'm already running out of gems. Let's do seven just to round it out. I'll, I'll charge a little bit, but nowhere near as much as usual. Give it a chance. Give it a chance for some good pulls. But otherwise, I don't know. It's just a shame with this game because it's like, it feels like a lot of, there's a lot of good potential for it. <laughs> so that can happen, huh? So that can happen. Interesting. <laughs> Messiah support is good. Yeah, Messiah support is good. All right, keep it up. Don't stop. How's my place in Japan? It's great. I might do a Q&A or something because people do ask a lot about um, my move to Japan. I've only been here for a bit over a week, like a week and a half right now, so it's not been that long. Um, but it's been amazing. It's been really amazing. I love where I live. I'm in a really amazing location, close to everything. My dorm mates are really sick. Oh, I, I haven't met that many of them, but the ones I've met are really cool. So yeah, I'm a big fan. Did you get one copy of each gear triple? I feel like we might have, yeah. Have we? Oh, we haven't. We haven't gotten um, Mes Meshkia yet, and we haven't gotten the PG, the Chronofang PG yet, so... Yeah, and I haven't gotten freaking Slayman. I want Slayman. Alright, we recharge a little bit. We're gonna reach to the 100 here, but and hopefully pull ourselves a Fides. I also um, went through a bunch of... Uh, went through a bunch of my character fight little things. Went through all the little character fight gems, picked some up, and now I'm sure that we can get some nice, nice Fides or Flagellates. And if we don't, I will cry. Cry. On stream, real. No way. All right, come on. I believe. I believe. Even though this is a sleeper skip set, I still believe. <laughs> I could have a nice little tangent to talk about overdress and now Fidiz will show up. All right, another Chrono Fang. Goodbye. Skip gang. All right, I can do this again. Crazy. Look at this. Oh, good omen. Who is that? Oh, it's a great two. Uh, that's fine. Yo, FS Mirul coming in with a five drop. All right, FS Mirul. This one's for you, buddy. Blessing up, lousy nerd, Goman, wise guard, Moken, Melinx, and Nini Chan. This one's for you, buddy. You see that? You see that? This one's for you too. Ugh, damn it! All right, we got the next one. You're missing a single gear triple. Yes. <laughs> Correct. <laughs> I appreciate it, buddy. Thank you very much. All right. All right. You know what? For FS Mirul. This next pack, you get to choose how I open it. Yeah, I'm pulling all the gear stuff because this set is all ge freaking gears. What do you expect? What do you expect? All right, Middle, do you want, how do you want this to, you know, how do you want your steak cooked, you know? Medium rare, well done. This is the kind of question I'm gonna ask you now, all right? So, do you want this? Do you want this in, from left? To right, from right to left, or do you want the potato chips? You know, when like you 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 open from the middle, you open from the middle the potato chips. You use feet. I'm I'm afraid you're gonna have to give some more subs for for, for feet opening. <laughs> Even an odd. <laughs> left to right. Oh, there you can go. Going with the standard. All right. Of course, sadly, we know these are commons. That's another thing, right? Used everything used to be hype. Oh, all right. Damn. Okay, the double double, the double double. We'll take it. All right. Let me let me do a potato chip. Shweep, shweep. All right. Double rare potato chips. I actually had some chips today. Damn. Doubles coming through left and right. FS Mirul is the one to thank for the blessings. All right. Come on. Show me. No cheeseburger. We don't need it. We just don't need it. We'll pull these horrible GRs anyway. <laughs> Come on. Give me the good side of these GRs. Come on, please. Just, just do me a favor. Okay. 
PG, can I have a grade one triple? Or have we pulled it already? That that one grade one that has like the, the Vanguard boost effect? Or what? Oh no, it's like when placed from deck due to time leap, that one. That's what I'm looking for. Nice. Yeah, this one. Not you. Not you. This one. This is the one I want. The one that I want. Do, 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 do. And also, Slayman, please. Can Why are there things that aren't gears not showing up? Wait, there's only two triples in this set that aren't gears. <laughs> XD? It's kind of funny. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Well, here we go again. It'll be like a... I'm, I'm serving serving a menu. Serving a menu. What would you like to drink? Would you like a GR? Would you like five triples? Or would you like garbage? Or would you like a conversion? Would you like to convert your water into whiskey? <laughs> Damn. Looks like it is. Whiskey it is. <laughs> Hold it like a baby. <laughs> My child. Zero Chan. Zero Chan. Are you okay? My poor child is dying. <laughs> one like equals one prayer. <laughs> Well, the, the blazer is delayed. My poor child. <laughs> one like equals one prayer. Please save him. <laughs> oh, Slayman. <laughs> My child. My child grew up with this slay Slayman. Crazy. I'm very honored. Oh. Damn. The boys. <laughs> the child who will trade for... Don't say that. <laughs> Alright. Come on. Young, young one. Please grow up to be a great GR. <laughs> Please grow up to be a great GR in the future. If you don't, I'll cry. That, that's, that's, you know what, that's a good one. That's a good GR to pull. I, I'm not gonna pop off. But I am happy. Like, does, does this need to flip? It, it does need to flip, right? Because GRs don't exist without flipping, right? Because how, how else does, does our child nurture into a you know, good citizen. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> well, that's cool. Yeah, you do need to personalize, don't you? But I guess two is enough. Two is enough. Maybe I can do something with Groovy, right? You don't need more than two, right? 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 <laughs> he asks for confirmation. Asks for not gears and cleans the box of gear cards. Built different. Constructed it in an alternative manner. Is it two of? Okay, cool, then I can craft it. Not too bad, wow! New deck and fight, new video, crazy. I can't believe it. Now, if only I could pull a Fides or a Flagiolet. At least with this month's free packs, I will definitely get one of each, so that's fine. Alright. Please, Mr. Zero. That's more like it. Now, give me the Fides, or we are gonna have trouble. Long, long. Okay. I guess when you go this far into the box, it's pretty cool. Ooh, is that SP? It is! Nice. Can I have another Slayman now? That'd be cool. No, okay. That's fine. Okay. More SPs, please, for more materials. One like equals one material. <laughs> Man, I, I love Gear Groovy's art, too, so I'm kind of glad I got one. As much as I've been talking shit, I'm glad I got the one. Because I he's probably, his art-wise, he's probably my favorite Chrono Jet form. Alright, come on. Give me the future I desire. Ooh! Mm, that's... Uh, the Brave PG's not that great. You'd still rather play the Count Charger, but hey! Flash your lead. That's good. Do I just reset here? Boys, I think this is a reset. For the last eight packs. <laughs> but thing is, my last eight packs are paid gems anyway. So I'm probably gonna be running them. It's a reset, yeah. Fides. Fidont. Fidelity card. It's a reset. Now, do we roll these last eight or do I just get, get them through the daily 50 discounted? I feel like we just get it through the daily 50 discounted. I think I want to still convey the message that I don't support these freaking split pack practices and these freaking summer $40 set pixel 
things when they could have been events and could have allowed people to get expensive, like, like you know, high rarity cards through an event after they've been out for almost, you know, half a year. So, it's a bedge set. I've got myself some cards. I can craft some other stuff. But, um, I think we'll call it there for the pack opening. So, not much, like, there's really not much to even, like, <laughs> conclude on. This set we skipped on, because honestly, the only GR in this whole set I would want is, like, the Neo Nectar one. And I'm fine to just craft it at this point. There's, like, nothing for Pale Moon. Grand Blue as well, to be honest, is really sleep. There's just nothing, like, this set, in, like, that. the other, like, freaking Blessing is just, like, don't, don't touch. Don't touch. Something bad will happen. <laughs> Something bad will happen. And then the, the fate side is like, okay. So yeah, um, my recommendation if you're thinking about opening this set, save for Luard, as somebody in chat said. Just save for Luard, it, you're literally doing yourself a solid. Um, Luard is probably gonna be good. Because if it's not, I think, you know, that's a missed opportunity, right? That's a big opportunity that they don't want to miss out on and i'm sure they won't want to miss out on it so uh let's take a look so we got one slayman two salims which is all right and then i think if i get rid of like sps and stuff i can get to 30k gr mats which is good um link joker i'll probably craft my my flagellettes because i do like the card um but really it's been quite a bare bones set Got a delayed blazer, which you know I can I can probably just upgrade my Chrono Jet, grind for two Chrono Jet G's and stuff like that. And, you know it's, they're gonna be rank rewards. Nothing too much else in this set is like super crazy. We pulled three of the Gear Chronicle GRs. That's not too bad. So yeah, I think that's a fine place to call it. Like this set's all right. This set is all right. The twelve G's on update is probably the biggest thing, and I think we will you know we will spend more of this month catching up on the things we've missed out on of these last two months instead of having to stress about the things in this set because there's just not much in this set that i really care about all right so that's gonna be it thank you guys for watching this pack opening i hope you guys enjoyed it even with this sort of scuffed setup um there'll be plenty of zero content but i also will probably make a video talking about the current state of zero pretty soon because i want things to improve and i feel like if i don't um I don't want it to become too late, that's all I'm going to say. So, thank you very much for watching, hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a like, and if you haven't already, please subscribe. We are literally like a thousand and like 200 subs or something away from 50k. Please, like we are literally getting closer and closer, and I'm getting impatient. Because I have a fun idea for a 50k special, and I'm just like, damn, I, I uh, can't, still can't do it, nope, still can't do it, yep, still can't do it. <laughs> So please, y'all. <laughs> anyway, guys, that's it for me today. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.